the princess and the Avatar's friends follow Zhao into the spiritual place. They watched in horror as the cruel Zhao killed the moon spirit. The princess, whose own gentle spirit was entwined with the moons, fell to the grass as if struck. The moon turned blood red, and the power of the water vendors was weakened. My uncle had warned Zhao not to tamper with the spirits. He attacked the commander, but the coward Zhao fled my uncle's wrath. As the battle raged on, I gathered my strength and freed myself from the ice. In the spiritual place, the weakened princess sacrificed her life to restore the moon spirit. The moon turned white once more, and the water tribe regained their bending powers. I came upon Zhao, staring up at the moon in disbelief that his evil had been undone. He was no less surprised to be challenged to a duel by a dead prince, but foolish enough to accept. I killed you. As in so many things, Zhao, you're wrong. A small miscalculation. Easily corrected! Your time is over. Give up! You can't win this duel! You can't even catch a little ball! Oh! <laughs> 
Water tribe soldiers everywhere. We had to flee the city at once. As I turned away, Zhao rose to strike at my back. But the waterbenders drowned him where he stood. The sacrifice made by their princess restored the waterbenders' powers, but the enemy had breached the defensive ice wall. The Avatar despaired that the Fire Nation would soon overwhelm the city. But when the Avatar was asked what he had learned during his meditation, he suddenly understood what he must do. As my uncle and I escaped in our lifeboat, the Avatar stood at the city walls. He raised his hands to bend the ocean itself into a towering wall. surged towards Lordo's eyes Armada, and then it stopped. As the wave's crest hovered over the fleet, the panicked captains ordered their ships to retreat. Satisfied, the Avatar folded the wave back into the sea. I wondered if he would prove to be the most powerful Avatar yet, but that did not matter. I would drag this boy before my father's throne. 
if I had to chase him to the ends of the world.